This is Sensei Buck Snyder. I'm a martial artist, nature lover, and total nerd. Come have fun with Sensei in the Wild. All right, what's up, YouTube? We got another insect today. Check it out here. This is called the red velvet ant. And look at that big red fuzzy thing. Now, while it may look like an ant, and the name may say ant, it's not actually an ant at all. It's actually a wingless wasp. And what's interesting is this is the female. Only the females don't have wings. The males do have wings. So this is a female. And here's something that's really cool about these things. The females have a sting to them. So they are venomous, but only the females. The males do not possess a stinger. So the males cannot sting you. But the thing about this female is her sting is so painful that people call it the cow killer because the uh, sting feels like it could kill a cow. It's so powerful. So if you look at her right now, she's agitated. We found her in the yard, and uh, she's just such a cool-looking insect. We had to do a video on her. So if you look at her, they're known to be very fast and evasive bugs. They run very quickly. They do defensive posture when they feel threatened. And then, as I said, the female will sting if she feels threatened. And one thing both the males and the females do is they'll hiss at you if they feel threatened. So they'll make a sound. Now, if it's outside and loud, you might not be able to hear it, but that's one thing they do to try to scare off predators. Now, these guys are considered semi-parasitic because what they do is they go find cicada killers, which is a very large kind of wasp, or other similar kinds, go into their nest, and they lay their eggs in the eggs and the larva of the cicada killer. So when that, their eggs hatch, they're born inside the larva of the other ones, and they eat them, and that's their host. So they eat that as their food, and then they come out into the world. So again, this is a, a female red velvet ant. And like I said, it looks like an ant. And of the species of these fuzzy kind of wasps that look like this, this is the biggest one that you'll find. So it can grow up to almost two inches long. And this one is almost full grown. So check her out. Very mean, aggressive wasp. Uh, like I said, known as the cow killer because of her painful sting. We're gonna take her and turn her free in just a minute, but I really thought it'd just be cool to share this one with y'all. Okay guys, we're outside at night now, and we're going to turn the red velvet ant free. And then we just got a nice little part of grass right here. And it's up there in that corner, so that's a good spot for it to be for us to take it out. Let's see, there we go. And she's running off now. She's still such a beautiful, though dangerous bug. She's very beautiful. All right, guys. Keep it wild. Oh. 